Welcome to day 11 of King of Trios. I'm Trevor. With me is Chris. Say hello. What's up? And here we have the Justice League versus Team Workhorse. A highly anticipated match, I'm sure. Yes. Especially with that freaking toupee on freaking Aquaman. <laughs> Aquaman looks so pretentious. It's so awesome. It looks like he's posing for a statue right now. It's kind of aggravating. I don't know. <laughs> Especially when you have everyone else in the ring. Like, you know, Antonio is, like, so intense. Everyone else is so intense except for freaking Aquaman. He just looks stoic. Uh, Speaking of stoic. Here's the exact opposite of that. <laughs> Maybe not us three. You know, just where we stand. We're taking this world on as a team, and everyone will understand we're the Justice League. <laughs> the Justice League. How did Justice League get here? I, I, I don't know. I'm perfectly confused on that myself. Especially with. Why is Batman uh, freaking Heath Slater? <laughs> well, if any of them were going to play air guitar, I, I would have hoped that it would be Batman. Well, you'd hope, but I'm going to say probably the most likely. Ah! Would be... Oh, God! <laughs> ah, so much Aqua Karate. <laughs> Aquaman's eyes right now. Oh, my God. He's gone from freaking picturesque to being absolutely horrifying. Oh, uh. God. And here we go. Air guitar. Hell yeah. Batman. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you're you got your DVR set right now because this is Batman Air Guitar. <laughs> so, so yeah, well, this we're still on the blue side of the bracket, but um, it, it's interesting to see where everyone's going to be going. But because we, we we've already had some interesting winners. Oh, and here we come, our team workhorse, and show how outdated this is. We have tag team champion Antonio Cesaro and Intercontinental champion Daniel Bryan. Woo! So outdated. That's right. Dan um, Daniel Bryan never lost that title, damn it. It's still real to me, damn it. Oh, it's a hell of a beard on him, too. Hell of a beard. Oh, yeah. And a hell of no one is back. Oh, I love their ring gear, too. It makes it look so much more authentic. Oh, yeah. Especially without Antonio Cesaro's King of Swing jacket. Yeah. I actually prefer that jacket over the King of Swing jacket. Yeah, cause, and he has, like, the European bands on him. He doesn't have any knee pads. It's a yeah. sol solid model for Cesaro. Yeah, and you know he's got a solid set of moves, as does Daniel Bryan, and as does Dolph Ziggler. So, you know, I'm kind of interested to see just how the Justice League is going to have to go up against a team like this. I know. Three actual seasoned wrestlers going against three superheroes. And honestly... Like the the superheroes, while they had the superhero pedigree, they aren't haven't been that successful in the magnation. Nope. You have Aquaman who almost was fired. He made the finals of March Sadness before beating Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> you know it's sad when you're barely holding on to your career over Sonic the freaking Hedgehog. And, and then you have the Green Lantern who I can't remember anything he's ever done in the magnation. And then you have Batman, who was a tag team champion with Robin. I'll give him that. Mm -hmm. But he's also the worst hardcore champion we've ever had. And that is saying a lot. He got interviewed by Jesus. Yeah. Oh, he, yeah, he got interviewed by Captain Pollution about Captain yeah. Pollution, and then Jesus jumped him and won the title off him. Yeah, that was... That was... That was god awful. Let's just not even lie. Is this? Is it? Is it? It's the yeah, it is. Woo! Hell yeah! Way to way to start. The oh movie. Jesus Christ! Well, I think we just killed Dolph Ziggler again. Oh my God! Batman's pissed off. All right. Okay. We might have a match here, ladies and gentlemen. I think Dolph Ziggler's already had a concussion. He yeah. probably already forgot last night. Yeah, we've only made it to one on one twice so far in King of Trios. We had um, the NWO and uh, the Faces of Fear make it to a one-on-one -on -one situation. And somehow we had uh, Mortal Kombat and um, the Colony make it to the final final two. Which is, always, which is always a fun thing to watch, in my opinion. I've always been more of a fan of uh, matches that don't look like, oh, well, this team's very much guaranteed to win because they have the overall numerical advantage. Yeah, it's been a lot of sweeps so far. I'll give it that. But... I, I, you know, I, I was impressed. I was impressed by the end of the colony match, and what sucked is how we got there. 
because um, that was the one match that I did that had uh, disqualifications in them and the countouts. Um, that's that's automatically annoying just off the premise alone. Yeah, that's my bad. It happens. It happens. And Daniel Bryan's putting in some work against Batman. I think this is a match everyone wants to see: the Goat versus the Bat. Oh Jesus Christ! Well, Damn. Jesus. Daniel Bryan is absolutely wailing on Batman. Ah, uh, I'm happy to see it, to be honest. Yeah, and Batman's taking it back, of course, because that's just how my commentary tends to work. Of course. Oh, nice! Nice and scary by Daniel Bryan. There He's you showing go. off that background and basically all of his indie wrestling. I know. He's I, showing it off really well. I'm proud of him, and, and this is how you can get healthy Daniel Bryan. When he's in a computer. <laughs> oh, that hurts me. I know. That, that way we can still have Daniel Bryan whenever we want him. Most useless move in wrestling. Woo! Daniel Bryan showing off that moveset. Where's he going? Oh, take it apart the table. All right. Hey! Hey! My diet soda! I, I think he heard the computer line, so he's taking a little bit of revenge. Uh, you know what? doesn't mean he has to ruin my soda. Man. Daniel Bryan's got a chair! <laughs> Daniel Bryan, what are you doing? <laughs> All right! <laughs> Look at where this match is going. <laughs> this match has gone straight from a, your average three-on-three three to pretty much a hardcore match in literally the moment of a step. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Aquaman, I don't know what you're doing, but you really need to stop. Quit there you go. Me. There you go, Aquaman. You might want to start doing stuff. Like right now. Green, Green uh, Lantern still hasn't done a damn thing. Well, there was Antonio Cesaro, so you know it's equal now. Yep. And <laughs> Daniel Bryan walking pa sauntering past Aquaman. Oh, shit! <laughs> yes! Yes! Do it! Do it! Oh, there you go! DDT through the table! Oh, this match has gone from a three to a five star in literally five moves. <laughs> this is amazing. Just the destruction of Batman in this match. And and the thing, Batman was such a house of fire against Dolph Ziggler. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> right. Justice League, what are you doing? This is a you're facing a go a concussion guy and a guy from Europe. Yeah. And Daniel Bryan accidentally hit Dolph Ziggler or something. Hey, that, that flying elbow is, and he trips over the stairs. Daniel, I, I, we already made this discussion earlier. We don't want you injured already. Oh, 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 oh shit! Into the Jesus! <laughs> and Green Lantern just watching. <laughs> Daniel Bryan, the shit that Daniel Bryan gives right now is impressively low. Oh, we, we just got rammed into the stairs. Well, yeah. Daniel Bryan is beating the shit out of the Justice League sing single-handedly right now. And that doesn't even count Antonio Cesaro, who's literally done jack and shit in this match. <laughs> yeah. I guess he's saving him for the next round or something. Oh, there he is. Nope. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> Daniel Bryan, the one-man army. <laughs> yeah. Screw Kryptonite. Screw anything else you can think of to beat the Justice League. Just send Daniel Bryan yeah. after him. It's now time to play the fun game called Who is Legal? <laughs> well, I know it's Daniel Bryan, and I think it's Batman. I think so. I, I know it's Daniel Bryan, because Daniel Bryan has basically been... Oh, Batman coming back! Jesus! <laughs> ba Batman... The impression kept him to the outside. Da uh, Daniel Bryan and Batman just straight shooting for the last five minutes here. It's been beautiful. Oh, this yeah. is absolutely just amazing. Whips him He's into the corner. Him. Is he going to take it Antonio Cesaro? Nope. Nope. Fuck it, we're not putting Antonio Cesaro into anything. We're like freaking Vince McMahon. <laughs> Where'd he even go? Oh, there he is. Sorry. <laughs> we don't even know. What the fuck name. is this? <laughs> fuck you, Aquaman. You, <laughs> <laughs> of course, just absolutely giving no fucks about the. And I think Green Lantern just abandoned Batman on the apron. <laughs> <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> this entire match is entirely developed into a clusterfuck, and I love it. <laughs> it is fantastic. And another elbow drop, and another elbow drop, and elbow drop. Woo! Cesaro! 
Finally! Yeah! <laughs> And Batman finally doesn't have to worry about anything anymore. Nope, Batman's dead. Batman, my Batman, we're going to miss you. You and... That, that's going to be a rivalry now. Batman versus Daniel Bryan. Yes. Match of the year, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, God. Oh, God. Green Lantern. Green Lantern. <laughs> Christ. Right out the freaking gate. Green Lantern is pissed off. What? Uh-oh. Oh, he's calling for something. Is that... Oh my god, he's using the yes lock on Dana Bryan! Oh god, yeah, because he can switch any moveset because he has the ring. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Somehow that makes sense. Oh, choke slam into a, just a backbreaker. Yep, from both Antonio Cesaro and Daniel Bryan, so you know this is going to hurt. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, uh, uh, tequila surprise, I think. Tequila nice. Oh, the knee! <laughs> Woo! Jesus! Hit him. Hit him! Oh, but he got to have the next one! And a drop toe hold from his feet being in front of him. Oh, Holy God. shit, is that the Brock lock? Nope, no, all right, got out of it. Fair enough. No, that... I don't know what that was, but Daniel Bryan's pissed. Oh, I know. Going after his neck. He you knows that that neck is his weakness. Aquaman running like... in for no reason. Aquaman is just going after Dolph Ziggler. Is that a torture rack? A torture rack. <laughs> Good lord. <laughs> the, the absolute... Cluster Duck in the middle of this ring is absolutely fantastic. This oh, is yeah. so much better actually than Singani's Zist versus um versus the Unwashed. I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, this is way better. I, I, I don't even know what's happening. Jesus! <laughs> belly to belly <laughs> suplex by Daniel Bryan. And we still have that chair just kind of hanging out in the corner. Uh, when is that even going to come into play? I really hope it does soon because this is quite incredible. European uppercut. Well, I, 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 I got it 50-50 whether or not it's going to come in play because it would be hilarious either way. Yeah, at this point, at this point, it would just make sense for the match for it. No oh time. God! <laughs> Antonio Cesaro killing fucking Aquaman. Why? Because he's Antonio Cesaro. Oh, the yes lock! Oh, oh what a rope really break! Fuck? And a rope break? Yep. What is this? Oh yeah, we got rope breaks here. We're not heathens. Oh. Darn it! <laughs> Dan and Brian going, going up. Oh my God! Uppercut. Taking the moveset right out of freaking Antonio Cesaro's hands. Cesaro's tagged in! <laughs> Finally, sweet Christ! Oh, God! He's going straight at him. And the closer, Cesaro. Cesaro needs to, get, or needs to keep up the momentum Daniel Bryan already gave him. I know, it's been all Green Lantern ever since he came in the ring, though. It, it makes you wonder why they even let Batman out of the cage in the first place. You just sent a Green Lantern. Yeah. Oh, God! Jesus. Here we go. He's rolling him over to do something. Still on the back of his arm there. It's a, he's stepping on the tricep. Cover. One, two. Yeah. Got him! And a stomp to the tricep is the finish for Breaking Green Lantern. That's yep. how bad his career is in the Magnation. Holy shit, the strength of Aquaman! Will Aquaman manage the one-man army? I don't think so, but it would be hilarious if it did. Will Aquaman do anything in this match other than get his shit caved in by uh, Antonio Cesaro? Uh, he's starting to look like he's starting to try to get it back into Antonio Cesaro. Continuing with his big, giant, Andre the Giant freaking elbows. Yeah. He does have a power game. I, I will give him that. Oh, the yeah, chair's not there. Good. I don't know if that's wise against the man who can toss Big Show like a freaking house of pancakes. Oh, yeah, you don't want to go with the power game with Cesaro. You will lose everything. <laughs> yeah, you'll lose everything and every time. Oh, here we go. Woo! And there go and down goes Aquaman to a blistering chest chop. Oh, cat, a spinning calf kick there. Well done. What's he going for? Just an another bruising elbow. The laziest cover in the world. One. Not even a two count. Two. Not even. Aquaman, you need to do more damage if you're going to beat Cesaro. Did you not see Cesaro versus Cena? That's right. And I feel like I could talk about that because this is totally non-canon. It is. And it was it, it was man, one of the matches of the year. I will absolutely say that. It was beautiful. I loved every moment of it. It was so good. Like, I, I had... I almost bought a Cesaro shirt that night, which I may buy it today, actually. Jesus! Oh! You just us. And, and, and on his stomach, too, because fuck you, Aquaman. I'm turning into fish sticks. <laughs> Hell of a bit. 
you know, to, su surprisingly for a guy like Aquaman, he's put up a lot of fight against Antonio Cesaro. One, two. Three. I know. Yeah, he, he's looked pretty damn impressive. Especially for being essentially absolutely worthless in a, throughout this entire match thus far. Oh, oh yeah. now. Where's he going? Springboard? Yes, sir. No way. Got him. Damn. Going out for he's another just, one? Got him. Fine pitch, Michael. <laughs> that's we, exactly what he, you know, that's what he'd say at this point. We fly on Friday nights, Michael. Cactus clothesline! Oh my god! <laughs> Fucking Aquaman, the horn coming out of Aquaman right now. He's looked better in this one match than he has in basically his entire career with us. In, in anywhere, really. Yeah. I mean, just no one has Aquaman doing anything. And what the hell was that? <laughs> Fuck you. Fucking Antonio Cesaro is getting his ship pushed in by Aquaman. Cesaro, what are you doing? I, I think Cesaro's just been taken aback in this match. Cesaro, get out of there, man. Cesaro, tag in Daniel. Do something, anything. Jesus. He almost just got taken out by Aquaman. Get out of there. <laughs> oh, my God. How did this happen? Fucking Aquaman. Uh -oh. Just taking it to Cesaro right now. Uh -oh. Cesaro's making a come. God, what? Cesaro, what are you doing? Cesaro. Cesaro! Oh! <laughs> Super, Superplex, this is over. Tags in Ziggler. Wise choice at this point. Daniel Bryan was the one-man army earlier, and Dolph Ziggler, well. Oh, sleeper <laughs> hole! It's over, ladies and gentlemen. Nowhere to go. Center of the ring. He's asking. He's asking. Ask him! Ask! Wow, this is actually taking a surprise. He got out of it! Oh my god! What? And and now I cover. One, two. Of course! <laughs> Alpha Slaver. Uh, say what I will about this match being amazing, but each and every one of those covers was just like, wait, what? Yep. After that? Why? And that pen you know, clicking like, means the team workhorse has moved on to the next round. Thank God. That's an awesome tag team. But I will admit this right now. The Justice League, especially Aquaman, was really surprising. Yeah, I, I gotta say, Aquaman looked really good in that match. Scary good. Especially against a guy like Antonio Cesaro, where, you know, we basically rode off freaking uh, Aquaman when it came to Cesaro. But no, it, it ended up having to be Dolph Ziggler. Yeah, Ziggler ended up finishing the match, which was just damn impressive. Damn the impressive. Fact, the entire fact that, well, for one thing, Dolph Ziggler can even remember anything about today, or, you know, the fact that Cesaro is even in that match, was actually quite impressive. I'm very happy with what just happened. Oh, yeah. Great match. Especially, especially because of what happens in this game, usually. The third man never gets tagged in. Nope. All right, everyone, thanks for coming out for this match, and we will see you tomorrow for day 12 or so. King Trios, say goodbye. Say goodbye.